Breaking news. Breaking news out of nowhere. Um, look, Tiggy Julian, the current Spain coach, has been announced. It's official. There are no songs signed, sealed, and delivered. He will be the manager of Real Madrid next season. Um, this is interesting. Um, obviously, so probably on on tonight's show. Remember tonight's show, I'll be doing a YouTube live from 9 p.m. again, you know, building up to the World Cup and so forth. But this is interesting. Pochettino was talked about, Wenger was talked about, Conte was talked about. So this comes out of nowhere. And I think that the whole Loptigi thing, it's really, for me, in my personal view, is let's see how Spain do. Because it'll be weird if Spain flop at the World Cup and they don't really do, and they don't do really well. And let's just say, worst case scenario, they don't come out of the groups. Then it's like, okay, should we really trust him to be the manager of Real Madrid? And when you look at how Spain play, you know, it is that whole passing game. Not to to the same extent as what Del Bosque was doing, but maybe Perez and people are thinking that, you know what, I think we need to go back to... Not really go back, but I think we need to create much more of a very passing Spanish kind of game, a very technical kind of game in that sense. So, um... This is strange. This is strange because you would think that it would be like a somewhat of a big name. And I just think that it is a huge departure from Pochettino to this. Again, guys, tell me, has Loptiki done anything of notes club-wise? Really? Because like, I don't think he's done anything. I don't think he's won any major trophy for any club. You know, Um. so is this risky? Because why are you taking this dude? And I think especially why take him before he has had... A tournament with Spain. That's the that's the whole risky thing. Why take it before he has, has had a tournament with Spain? But let's just paint a, a best case scenario. Best case scenario, Spain, he either wins the World Cup or they come really close playing really good football. And in that case, then it's like, oh wow, man, this is really exciting. Who knows who who he can bring? Who know, um who who knows how he can make, pretty much play make Real Madrid playing a better, exciting football that is much more pass-based, that could be conducive and and better built to actually do well in a 38-game season. So we will unpack this more, get much more of a down low on this, but at the moment, very surprising, very shocking, pretty risky, because he's not really had the World Cup yet with, with Spain. But who knows, maybe the Real Madrid people know something that we do not know. But yeah, this is... Um, hmm... Thank you for watching this video. Think about pledging and become a Half of Football Hot patron. Pledge an amount each month and gain access to exclusive videos from your boy, the Football Hot, for more analysis. Peace.